Now, legal luminary affair Babalola has warned the federal government against tampering with the academic calendar of private universities without justification. The university founder reacting to a debate on whether schools should reopen on Monday, 18th January or not, says the lockdown experience and other closure have affected the finances of private universities owners while distorting their stable calendar. He insists that many private universities have passed the tests of COVID-19 compliance, unlike public universities which he describes as not ready for resumption and weak in capacity to check the spread of COVID-19. He wants government that blanket rules that could delay resumption of private universities will only affect youth negatively and damage the nation's education system. Keeping schools closed in movement longer than is absolutely necessary, socially intolerable, economically sustainable, and morally indefensible. Without the something of formal education, generation of students likely to have its employment and earning prospects blighted. If mass orders, they don't distinguish between anybody. I'm of the firm view that the mass closure of schools is unconstitutional, disastrous, and counterproductive. It is only unjust to the parents, to students, teachers, and proprietors of schools like me, and also violates the rule of natural justice. You know what that means anyway. When you talk about natural justice, you must see the other side. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.